people are gonna walk in and be like, what have you been doing? A mom hack that helps me with keeping things kind of organized when I'm cooking. It's warm. Oh, he yells at me, eh? Yay. He knows me down this one hallway and I walk past and I know he's there too. Hello, hello everyone. Welcome to the day. We're glad you're here. Please like, subscribe, comment, all that fun stuff, and we're glad you're here. Come over every day, we appreciate it. Today, you guys, I am going to be making a after-school snack for the kids that I super love. I love pastries, I love cream cheese. Put them together and it's just, oh, it's heaven. I, I, just, I love it, so good. So today, for an after-school snack, I'm going to be making a lemon cream cheese pastry. It's really super simple, super delicious, and I'm gonna help you, uh, I'm gonna show you guys how to make it. This recipe, you guys, it's gonna bake at 350 for about 30 minutes. So before you get started mixing it together, you wanna get your oven preheated. And then you need two soft packages of cream cheese, this is eight ounce. This is the generic brand. For both of them together was under $2. So this is actually, quite inexpensive to make. So I've got these, they're softened, and then I have two lemons zested. The smell, you guys, oh my gosh. Lemon zest, like real lemon zest, smells so good. Just smells clean and fresh, I absolutely love it. So I've got them zested, and now I need to juice them, so you need two le uh, lemons, juiced and zested, two tablespoons of melted butter, and then a uh, half cup white sugar, two tablespoons melted butter, and three tablespoons of white sugar. Here I have a nine by 13 pan that is lined in tin foil and sprayed with cooking spray. You line it so that you can lift the pastry out of the pan to let it cool and to cut it and stuff. So that's a step that you don't want to skip. Okay guys, you want to make sure you line it and spray it. <laughs> Excuse me, I hiccuped. Now we need to mix our ingredients. So I've got the two lemons juiced and in the bowl. Now we need one and a half zested lemons. Got this for Christmas from my mom. To the cream cheese and lemon juice and zest, I'm adding half a cup of sugar. Now we're just gonna mix it all together and put it on the pastry. All right, so I have my prepared dough in my pan. We're going to add the cream cheese mixture to that and then we're going to top it with the second dough. It smells so good. Oh. I'm gonna try and get it as even as possible. But it doesn't have to be perfect. It'll taste just as good. Okay. Oh, that always scares me. I'm gonna put away my pastry brush. And this is just two tablespoons of melted butter. I'm just gonna brush it on the pastry. Croissant dough. Next, you're going to combine three tablespoons of sugar to the leftover lemon zest, and it's just gonna make a little, it's, ew, you guys, it smells so, so good. Your home is gonna smell like, oh, it's a lemon and cream cheese. It's gonna smell so wonderful. People are gonna walk in and be like, what have you been doing? You're all, eh, you know, just making some, Lemon cream cheese pastry, you wanna have some? There's nothing like the smell of home cooking, you guys. It just, you can't replicate it. You can't put it in the candle, you can't put it in lotion. It's just, oh, it just smells so, 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 so good. So I'm just sprinkling this on here. And it's gonna add a little bit of a crust to the top of this pastry. and I'm making a huge mess, but that's okay. That comes with baking too. 
<laughs> it all cleans up. <laughs> it's all part of it. Uh, I'm trying to teach my kids that, you know. They like to bake and be in the kitchen and cleaning up is part of cooking, you guys. All right, I think that's just about good. Okay, we're gonna pop this in the oven for 30 minutes. It smells so good already. <laughs> so excited. Oh, too far. While that's baking, a mom hack that helps me with keeping things kind of organized when I'm cooking is I like to have a sink full of soapy water just right there. Um, oftentimes when I'm baking, I need to reuse a measuring spoon or a measuring cup or something like that. So having a sink full of soapy hot water so you can just quickly wash them, it makes it makes it all go really efficiently and really quickly. And then your kitchen isn't like a bomb went off. <laughs> it's easier to keep clean. And um, if you can, you know, you can lick the beaters. <laughs> clean them off a little bit before you wash them. My kids aren't here, so I have to do it. You know, sacrifices you gotta make, you guys. <laughs> That's a little mom hack for you. Right, it is out and cooling. It needs to cool for 20 minutes and then we'll just lift up the tin foil and we'll cut into it and I'll feed it to my kids. There's one guys, of them. Guys, guys. Yes, Jack. Guys. This is Jack, by the way. God. If you're new. You if you're new, sorry. Oh, okay. I was about to say. <laughs> um, also, oh yeah. Guys, I learned in choir today that I'm a, I'm a tenor. And that means that I can go not as low as most, actually half of the boys, mm -hmm. but I can go low still, and I can go almost as high as the girls can be. So. Whoa, that's amazing. Yeah. Wide range, that's what that <laughs> means. It's warm. Oh, it oh, sorry, that was a really big bite. Mmm. See, it's a smile. I'm happy. It's really good. It's light. It's cream cheesy. It's sweet, but it's a little tart with a lemon. It's just fresh. I love it. It's good, Hal. You like it? Your sweet. You like it? Mm -hmm. Yay, oh, that makes me some, happy. We should take one to McKay tomorrow because we made him for him when he was in the hospital. That's a good idea. Like, remember that one time? Remember that, that one we time? we barely knew each other. There was the most awkward situation <laughs> on your porch and I was giving you these. But our moms are friends and so I brought you a gift. <laughs> that was so weird. But we're friends now, guys. Don't worry. That's good. Okay, you guys. We went and dropped the Littles off home, and that Jeep's lights are on. Uh -oh. the, <laughs> we are actually, mom and I are chaperones at what, it's called a steak dance, it's a multi-steak dance, so it's a huge youth dance that's over here, and they've got a live western band, and it's awesome. <laughs> Hallie's in there dancing, um, and Miley's on our way here, but we'll go in there and I'll sneak my phone out and get some video of those guys in there doing the, the steak dance. Really it's cool. really cool. The band that's playing is really so awesome. So, but we get to be chaperones and eat the pizza and just hang out. So, it'll be, it'll be fun. I'll, <laughs> we'll, we'll take you guys inside and show you what it is. It's, it's awesome. <laughs> <laughs> and a ton of watermelon.
it. It's a late night. The dance is over, but we are gonna crash out. So, good night. See you tomorrow. Be good. I thought Jack would be freaking. Jack? <laughs> it's different, you can tell. Oh, you got nothing. Stop it, just go. <laughs>